Welcome back to another long, boring, and awful VOD. Uh, today we are playing FTL as the stealth ship, uh, the Nisasio. Uh, we are still trying to clear the game with all of the A types of the ships. A and we have our crew, which is all uh, based on secret names. So our captain, Ryan Secret. Uh, we have KGB as our, um, as our engine man. And our uh, gun lady is Top Secret. So... Getting started here with hopefully a crew that will survive most of our journey through outer space. We do not have shields to begin our adventure. Uh, and we have some augmentations that will be useful for us looking ahead. But maybe if we trace from here to here to here, we may be able to avoid combat and just get free money. Like... A ship with conspicuous pirate markings, it must be a pirate, is orbiting a nearby moon, broadcasting a simple message claiming to have equipment available for s Maybe they'll have something for sale. Uh, attack him before he can attack. We don't even have any money, so I wouldn't use it anyway. So just screw them. Let's uh, fight them instead. Fortunately, it's only two pirates. You know, if I could get this mini beam to work, let's just move the dual lasers there. We will continuously shoot their shields. This mini beam is rather intractable and difficult to aim, though, in my opinion. Okay, can I get the ion to shoot me as well? Okay, sweet. 90% evade is not that bad. Not that bad. It's a pirate. It has pirate markings. It must be a pirate. Do you think I can get all four rooms if I do this? Like, is there one... Ah, it seems like... Is it even possible for me to get all four? Wait a second, right there. The, aiming the laser in this game might be one of my favorite activities. Ooh, I did get all four rooms. I will not accept surrender. That's not a very good offer. I know I might get hit, but look at how many systems we just took out. They're really messed up now. There's no way they're... Yeah. See, that's what we need. Good, like, laser RNG early on will save us from any potential snafu that we may encounter later on in our campaign. Pew, pew, the ship goes. You come across a rebel automated scout ship pursuing a civilian ship, weapons engaged. Of course, we will aid the citizens. Uh, unfortunately, this is not the fight I wanted at all. Okay, it's going to fire. Am I willing to just take one hit from the drone? Nah, let's not even let the drone hit us. Let's just see if we can get a clean poop in. Okay, I will take a drone hit here. Okay, we shoot the shields. Please, God, get through. Okay, there we go. Good. Now we just take out their guns and their drone. Please, mini beam. Okay, the drone has been averted. The drone crisis has been averted. Uh, we will keep going for the shields and then just beaming their weapons and that. That looks good. We avoided getting hit with a missile, but also we are being set on fire. Uh, I don't like that at all. This ship is extremely susceptible to fires. Ooh! The ship what you saved was badly damaged in the battle. Most of the crew accepts your offer to be dropped off at a nearby. One offers to join the crew. Welcome aboard, Oni. This is actually a great crew member to have uh, because we just... Look how desperately we need help with fire. Um, yeah, look at their fire extinguishers. That's nice, right? Oh, oh, Jesus Christ, this is not good. We are taking whole damage due to fire. Didn't I tell you Oh my gosh, three fires in one room. This is getting worse and worse. Uh, jeez, Louise. Come on, three guys, just one fire. Literally one fire. Please take it out. That's why I hate this ship. This is not an easy ship. It's a difficult ship, I would have to say. Here, secret, you stay back. Oni, you go in there. All right, I need another secret name for our new insect crew member. So if anyone thinks of one, go ahead and feel free to write it in. Write it in like a letter, and I'll, uh, I'll, I'll add that in. Thank you. Okay, we'll send Topsy, Topsy and KGB. KGB, you can go back to the engines. Captain Secret, you stay up at the front. And then Oni, you might as well get good at repairing because you're not very useful and... Um, I'm going to go ahead and save crew positions. I might even keep him in for door duty. Or cameras may be more useful here, arguably. But we don't want fire spreading, so I think the doors is fine. 
Hmm. C I A. Like C low in incognito. That actually sounds like a convincing alien name. Incog. In cog. Nido. There we go. Incognito. Nido, short for eggnog eater. It goes to Kaizan. Very good name. Incognito. I think if I leave him on doors, that prevents the fire spread from occurring so rapidly. Because look, if you want to deoxygenate the ship, you need to open up all of these doors. Honestly, a Lanius crew member would be pretty cool here. But where are we going to find a Lanius crew member? So I figure this is the best I can do, right? Um, this dress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Okay, this one could be good or it could be bad, I'm pretty sure. Um, because we could lose a crew member. But am I willing to take that risk? No, I try to play zero risk on this game if I can. No one counts zero also. Welcome into the chat. No, I, I, I don't... I mean, normally, if I weren't doing it on a... Here's my thing, is that when I stream it, I like to be fairly assured of what events I'm picking. Like, if I can totally avoid danger, the ultimate. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, a Mantis ship, which has, unfortunately, only one Mantis aboard. Uh, they seem to have taken down our... Like, all of our system. What have they done here to us? This must be the work of the NGs. I dislike them and their kind... Uh, honestly, though, not a very threatening weapon set, so we should be fine here. I'm thinking we could just power down their weapons. Okay, they've ioned us, so now we could just go stealth boy. Now we go in for a beam. Beam. Uh, honestly, let's take the weapons out. Can we somehow get... Yeah, we could get three rooms with that hit. Okay, so that takes out the ion beam. Also, their oxygen, so that gives them something to work on for right now. Jesus. I forgot that I just don't even have shields, so I'm vulnerable to the beam to begin with. All right, but they're immediately dead. This ship is pretty good because of the mini beam early game. That power scaling is going to die down, though, fast. Like, we in trouble is what I'm trying to say. I say that we go here and then snake around because we got to get a store, man. Pirate engies. All right. They come out with the hacking. Unacceptable, honestly. Uh, what will they hack? Okay, cameras, who, who really cares? It makes zero difference on this ship. Uh, so I'm willing to just wait until that missile fires. And I'm not really worried about the hacking, so I think I'll go for the, like, their piloting, maybe? Okay, here comes the missile. And good, we've avoided two for one. Uh, I will go with that. Yeah, it's like feeding a baby. Here comes the miss, except like it's not a, like a, a piece of food. It's, it's a missile, unfortunately. Actually, we'll just keep going for piloting because the hacking makes zero difference here. Pew, pew. Nice. Something just satisfying. The, the sound effects in this game are great. Ah. Good, well, we have a good amount of scrap and we rich is what I'm trying to say. And we're not really in danger in most of these fights, so even though that we don't have shields, we're, we're doing a pretty good job avoiding that. Uh, there are two ships within range, and they seem to be engaged in battle. I, I will aid the civilian ship in fight, because I am lawful good. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I'm lawful good. Maybe not, though. Maybe that's a sign of corruption on my part. You know. Oh, I bet you we could get a five for the price of one here. Look at that. Ooh, that's a nice beam. Wait a second. Oh, I thought I hit. I just barely missed the stealth button. Ooh, that didn't actually hit their. Ah, oh, I missed that. Fortunately, their shields are now down. Okay, uh, just take that out immediately because we are in danger in like a second from now. Maybe I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade my stealth if we can't find any shields soon, only so that my stealth will just last longer. Because in the absence of shields, work with what you got, you know what I mean? Like if we were to do something like this, change our cloak from five seconds to 10 seconds, a 15 second cloak is pretty good, pretty good. Embrace the darkness, reap the chaos among the stars. 
Only the fi uh, yeah. Wait, is this one of those? Because we're fighting the rebels, so we're like the Federation, right? That's true. I did run in Rimworld organization. How organized it is in here. All right, we aren't really doing very well on the weapons front, so I'm going to change our stealth to a whopping 15 seconds stealth. A whopping, <laughs> whopping. Uh, should we do this event? I think we could like circle around here, go back. Maybe we'll even do this one. I'm okay with a possible ship, but let's try out the distress signal and see if we get anything interesting there. That's usually a good sign. Um, okay, cool, beam weapon, we got a good event. Uh, ooh, another distress signal. We could do a store after that. Depending upon how much money we have, we might be able to get a lot done here. I didn't anticipate we would even get any store in this galaxy. You have encountered refugee ship. Uh, hail them, hail them. Okay, uh, fuel for a missile. We aren't really using missiles right now, so yeah, I'll take the extra fuel. That gives us tons of fuel. Um, I'm thinking we go one, two, we go one, two, three, four to get out of here. Yeah, I'll go one, two, three, four. Counting with AA. Everyone get ready for the counting lesson. Uh, okay, these people are trying to get away. Stop them. Uh, hmm. I think again, go for shields and then beam. But I can stealth now. We prevent any untimely drone attack. Uh, I think we gotta go for weapons and drones here, so if we can somehow... This beam is just not enough. Ah, look at that. Like, you... It's so close to being able to get four arms. It does do damage per room hit. Okay, I'm just gonna go for the normal boy, uh, room attack. Let's see if we can get a crew member in that beam, too. Just prevent that drone or the weapons from doing any type of damage to us. And then Neum, good, their weapons are down now. And it appears as if the drone is down as well. Keep the fire on the ship. Actually, honestly, just keep doing exactly that. Except that they're trying to escape. So maybe if we do that, and then if we shoot the, the laser at the weapons, actually. Or uh, we'll keep it on shields, just because they're going to recharge fast. And then we'll do that. Yeah, that'll get the engines and the drones... And then the weapon will also have to charge anyway, so that'll be safe. Good. They didn't even get away. See, that 15 seconds stealth is honestly pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, relying on the bees, we just need some better way of getting through shields. Uh, okay, we did get shields. It's going to be too expensive. Uh, um... I mean, I feel like we're going to have shields available in the future. I like a lot of the stuff here. Um, I don't really want to sell my weapons because my weapons just aren't that good and I don't have much else to do here. You know, I think we could do without the long-range scanners if we wanted to buy hacking. Fire suppression. Honestly, fire suppression just for itself would not be bad for this ship. Uh, I'd eventually want other stuff, but... This is only the first... We did okay for the first galaxy, in my opinion. Um, automatically puts fires out throughout the ship. Honestly, just because this ship is going to be so bad at that, I think it's going to save us some time. But we want to prevent the fires from happening in the first place. You guys want me to do it. I've never done it, so I'll do it. Yeah, I feel like shields is just going to be putting money into something that we're like... Not even very... Like, why go into it if we're not going to go all the way into it, right? <sighs> but though we do want a good offense first. Is there anything that would give us a good offense? Not really. So let's go ahead and just buy... Keep it simple, buy fire suppression. I don't want to overcomplicate this matter. Yeah, unpreventable fires like solar flares. Honestly, a valid point. A valid point, Golden CS2. Ooh! Reward, anti-combat drone. I like getting drones because I always just resell them. I think we can go to pirate controlled and then we get three nice civilian controlled ones. Honestly, I prefer the pirate controls over the nebulas just because nebulas power down parts of your ship and it's a pain and you can't see as much. I don't like them. I don't want them. Uh, this is a danger. We can mostly avoid that kind of thing though. Asteroid field is basically death for us though. So no, absolutely not. Okay, another pirate. Uh, 
uh, it's taking out its. Hang on a second. Okay, stealth boy. Let's see, 15 seconds stealth. But the combat will basically be over by the time we get that. Okay, nice. See, see. Ooh, well, unfortunately, the fire does automatically get put out. But yeah, see, we've already got all of their weapon systems disabled and everything. So they never even get an opportunity to hit us in the first place. See, that is the secret to these types of games, is to lean in hard to one strategy that works. Fire suppression, a nice defense mechanism. But basically, if our first salvo of missiles, like, if something goes awry with those, we're dead, we're toast. But, if it works out in the beginning, we okay. Okay, looks like we got a quest, nice. Ooh, a very close quest. The rewards will be great and uh, and very like lucrative. Yeah, the long range sensors are helping this ship avoid anything that it honestly should not encounter. Uh, okay, I think this is a fairly obvious beam. There may be some way to get like, I know you could theoretically. Is there like one pixel of, yeah, look, I got it. Let's see if that manages it. This is just amazing for avoiding missiles and stuff like that, though. I want to get a little bit more so that we get that up to 100% evade. Because 90% isn't quite enough for me. Look at that nice beam. Ooh, good-looking beam right there. Take on the dual lasers. Do we manage to get two charge beams in? No, we don't, unfortunately. So they do get a hit off on us. But still, like only one point of damage for that whole thing, and they repaired our hull. Ooh, nice. Prevents weapon fire from disrupting the cloak, allowing you to, ooh, this is this is game if we get this. Game over. Okay, sell, um, uh, what is not as important. Long range scanners is gonna become less and less valuable over time. Fire suppression I kinda like because I just got it, and you know, we're really not very good at putting out fires. Drone recovery arm? I would do it if it were scrap recovery arm. Um, unfortunately, I'm not such a huge fan of it. I don't really like these other weapons. Uh, let's see what else they've got. They do have shields. We could get shields. I'm going to go ahead and sell... Well, we, well, we'll sell our anti-drone drone. Uh, a drone that hates itself. Uh, I'm thinking I'll sell the long-range scanners for 15, but we could buy... Yeah, of these three augmentations, this is going to get less and less useful as the game goes on because we just want to survive. Um, I don't hate the titanium system casing. Mm. I think I'm going to take out the long range sketch. I just, I personally don't like them. I mean, they're kind of useful right now, not going to lie, but uh, stealth weapons is just too perfect for this ship. Uh, now we can kind of switch out augmentations as we need them. That makes us more combat ready. Now we've got 58. Could we sell anything else potentially? Fire suppression stealth weapons. I want to keep these. Titanium system casing would bring us up to 98. And we could sell... I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to sell both of those for shields. Shields will keep coming back up. We just want to save 125 because we will eventually need shields. Uh, but stealth weapons goes perfectly with this ship. Cool. I think we're good. Nothing else I could really do. I don't like the other stuff that much. Let's go ahead and repair that room really quick. Also, Dr. Nick, thank you very much for the sub. I appreciate it, my friend. Yeah, you know what? I wasn't even noticing during those fights that, yeah, our, our stealth weapons were de-stealthing when, you know, stuff went awry. Although I'm going to kind of miss those long-range scanners now. You know, I don't think... I think I sometimes underestimate how much I actually like the long-range scanners. Okay, I'm also thinking, though, that I want our evade to 100% for these fights. So let's go ahead and get one more engine power. And that way we could take some off of... Uh, well, we need another power, so we're going to need, like, another seven scrap. But we could briefly turn off our oxygen when we, like, try to evade something. Until we get just a little bit more scrap if we have to. Also, Joshua, thank you very much for the prime. Hmm. Hey, my conception, how are you doing? Uh, you find the source of the distress call, a small research station. It appears a small laboratory fire got out of control. It's threatening to destroy. Uh, fire is a, uh, 
Uh, yeah, I believe it's option two, right? Thank you, Gold. Yeah, I believe it is. Two or three. Yep, we did get another prison. Okay, great, a rock. He will be good at putting out fires if we end up having to give up our system. Um, I'm thinking it would be nice to have him over here. He's rather slow, so he can't really get to other parts of the ship. It would be nice to have him in a central location. But, yeah, I mean, yeah, automatic fire suppression is pretty cash money. Okay, I need a name of a secret rock. Um, like some sort of stone, a mineral will do if anyone... Um, uh, if, any, if anyone has any rock names like Igneous Incognito. Hmm, unobtainium. Hmm. 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 Covertonite. I like that. Yeah, that is kind of nice. Some of them, that sounds like a secret agent. James. Quartz James. Obsidian. Why is obsidian? Am I missing it? Uh, Bertha. Sec secret mentory. Oh, like uh, sedimentary. Billy Crystal. Honestly, Billy Crystal is not a bad name. I like the celebrity theme. I'm going to go with Billy Crystal. That's nice. BMT8909, it goes to you. Billy Crystal. Welcome to the ship, Dr. Billy Crystal. There we go. After the f uh, famous rock celebrity, um, Billy Crystal, who was actually a rock. No one knows about this, but he is. All right, let's go back to the store. I'm thinking, ooh, this is not good. We're gonna have to go back over an old place, but who really cares? It doesn't make a big difference. We'll go here, then we gotta go to the store if we wanna get out of here, just because we can't jump from that. I thought we could go from here to here. Never mind. That's Dr. Billy Crystal to you. I received a message from us. They're looking for some military offering to improve your reactor and stage. You know, we really aren't using either of these, so I'm going to go ahead and agree to the trade. Upgraded the reactor. Basically, just free power. Uh, go back to the store. I wish there were an undo button in this game sometimes. Decent reactor. Decent reactor. We could power on the med bay all the time. Luxuriantly. I think we'll go here and then ar around back. So we could see what's in the south side. Oh no, I hate this. Why have I done this? Although I think that the stealth allows us to evade asteroids as well, right? Uh, I will turn it on honestly right now because we got that upgrade. Oh no, it didn't work at all. And now they just hit our oxygen. Uh, why don't you two go in there? Because your jobs are basically worthless. Uh, and then I will go about this. Thank God our evasion is at least somewhat decent. We will just stealth. The rocks won't be able to see us. Oh, <laughs> uh, God. Uh, where is their... Their drone is going... Okay, God, they're going for our oxygen, and we haven't upgraded our oxygen yet. Yeah, we need to take out that hacking immediately. Very bad. Honestly, very bad. Oh no, they've now hacked the oxygen. We need to kill these people, like, immediately. Otherwise, we will just run out of air. Oh, this is bad. I shouldn't have come here. I regret this. Fortunately, the oxygen is now back online, at least temporarily. Please. We have to survive. Oh, we have to stay, remain stealthed against the very deadly rocks. Do we have any way of redirecting to our engines? No? Okay, we just have to get out of here, like, ASAP. Oh, we can jump now. Hang on a second, wait until they repair that room. Okay, we're jumping now. I don't care if we're still kind of far away from civilization. Uh, honestly, I don't think we're gonna be able to get to that store. I need more scrap. This is where long-range scanners, honestly, would have been a good... a good option. See, I am immediately corrected by my own uselessness. Uh, I think we could do better if we attack this pirate. Yeah, we'll be fine. Uh, okay, you two. Honestly, we kind of need this system fixed. Like now. So just get close to the end of your life. There you go. Uh, nice. Now prepare the beam. Also, arrow as well. Thank you very much for the sub. 
Billy, why does he keep singing in the ship? Ah. Very nice, Billy Crystal. Okay, we've been shot. I'm going to uh, stealth us. Now I will use the mini beam for the purposes of which it was intended. Uh, we don't care about the door system, but can I get, again, can I get four rooms? I might be able to here, but I'm honestly just going to be slightly lazy. Let's just do that. Aw, didn't even take out the shields. What a waste. I suppose that hitting the engine is kind of useless here, though. But look, we stay stealth for like two whole weapon barrages. That's insane. We were just stealthed the entire fight. It's such a dub. Or, uh, not really a... It's more of a... It's actually more of a vibe to fight like that. Ooh, okay. Automatic fire suppression is going to come in handy in this fight. Although I do believe... Do we take hull damage from, uh, whatever the thing is? The evil star shooting us? Hang on a second. I think I can get four with this hit. I can totally do this. Nothing is stopping me. Just have to do it there. And nah. Again, I'm not going to try to be the hero. I'm not trying to break any hearts today. Okay, the missile is coming. It's time to go. Okay, now we're at 95% of eight. I do trust that slightly more. Now only one out of every 20 missiles hits us. Ooh, augment weapon. <gasps> Ooh, this is a really good augmentation. I'm willing to take this. Because that basically gives us three weapon hits before the enemy has a chance to retaliate. Um, I'm going to get rid of our titanium system casing. I know it's pretty good, but I'm, I'm more willing to take that. This is an amazing trio of things. Stealth, weapons, fire suppression, and we are, uh, titanium system casing. Honestly, though, the fire suppression is going to get less and less useful. Plating that provides a 15%... So that's basically a 15% invulnerable save. Um, and also, the hull will still be damaged. I'm not crazy about titanium system casing. Uh, I kind of like the fire suppression more, just because... This ship is very easily going to go on fire. Later on, maybe when we have the crew to reliably put out fires, I'll be okay with that. But there's something about this that's just nice. Yeah, okay. I'm willing to live with that. I mean, look, we just jumped into the sun, after all. I don't want more things to go wrong. Uh, I think if we go here... The, uh, yeah. Actually, let's just answer the distress call right now. It's kind of iffy, because one, two, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to get this one, and this one, and this one. Wait a minute, one, and they're, like, basically engulfing. Yeah, we're just going to be able to get two more. Unfortunate. But that's the reality. I've encountered a refugee ship. Oh, uh, yeah, we've got a board. Completely abandoned. Wait, just a distress call with nothing? That's honestly bad. I think we could pretty much stealth our way out of the fight, although just the fact that we get only one fuel if we don't win that combat, I'm just going to leave. This was a hostile controlled sector. I didn't like it. Okay, we will aid another civilian ship. I am willing to do that. Look at how good this is. I mean, we're going to need more firepower for the next galaxy. No cap, but... Wait a second. Uh, we got to wait on the mini beam now. Okay, now, ooh, this ship, ooh, this ship is nice and vulnerable to us. Look at that. Basically, we've already won the fight immediately. If we get other, now we could go for very expensive sh uh, guns. And we have only three slots for weapons on this ship, after all. We might not even have to stealth at all in this fight. It's become so completely irrelevant. Look, we didn't even have to stealth. Just the weapon pre-igniter won us the fight. Ooh, that's a lot of scrap. Very, very nice. Honestly, very nice. We will go to the next sector now. The Zoltan. Ooh, might pick us up a, a Zoltan crew member. Get even more power that we have no use for. Oh, this galaxy is horrible. I hate it. Uh, we have to get through... It appears like two nebulas before we get anything else going. Um, might go down without power. Oh, yeah, get a Zoltan shield. 
don't oh we we I oh, know that was during one of my failed playthroughs that I got that. I think we need better guns because now people are going to start to have two layers of shields. We can barely get through that if our weapons just like hit the shields, but then we got to beam the shield area. So it is kind of tricky. I want to save money. Uh this ship can get shields. Yeah, I don't I I agree. I'm just thinking is there anything we can upgrade on the cheap? That would like help us a lot, like one oxygen blip in case if we do get hacked in that. No, I think that our ship is just pretty strong right now. I'm willing to live with this. Yeah, the shield is going to start to be needed. See, like this guy's stealthed right away. Oh, wait a second. Uh, Crew, return to your positions. Ah, oh, what a waste. Look, they've already got their weapons ready. Okay, I will just do this, I guess. Uh, see, that was useless in this fight. Unfortunately. But now we have this nice, long uh, shield charge. Or stealth charge, rather. I I'm actually starting to like this ship even more. I thought I would hate this ship. I thought this was, like, the difficult run. But no, it's pretty easy. Like, if you know what you're doing and if you just lean into the strategy that's kind of working for you with the stealth, you know what I mean? Like, it could work. It could work. How many runs have I won, and how many of those were without Vulcan? Oh, I've actually, I think I've run only, won only one run without Vulcan. Although, I've been playing on easy, just because the RNG generally, like, tends to not horribly ruin the playthrough. Like, if I were playing on my own, I would play it harder, but... When I play it for Twitch, when I fail a run, I just get very, like, demoralized. So I'm trying to master the game completely on easy mode. And then I will start to create more of a challenge for myself. I feel like I should be able to get four in here. Nah, okay, we'll just get the three bigger systems. Let's make sure we get the rock man in this hit. Coming for you. Uh, that is not a very good offer. Come on, you gotta give a better offer if we're going to kill you, right? So their weapons just merely stop charging for a moment, momentarily. My next run is gonna be with the Mantis, I believe, like the second Mantis ship. It's such a cool ship because it has four borders at once. Okay, we could go to the store right now. I think 200 is enough to buy a good, oh, actually, yeah, we'll go there because otherwise I have to go to a nebula, all right doing it. We would never do boarding party on this ship, probably. Probably not. Okay, shields and a backup battery. I'm thinking that's going to be a good look for us. Uh, drones useless. These guns I'm not crazy about. Uh, let's see. I'm thinking... I wonder if you went through with a hull laser. There are two shots per charge. It could work. It could work, potentially, but burst two is always going to be my favorite. I'm thinking shields. We just take them now. We take a shield system... We might even do a backup battery. We might not even really use these for a little while. But backup battery is pretty reliable. It's basically just a free upgrade, so I'm going to take it. Drone control, nope. Uh, do I take Yaz? Nah, I mean, I've already used up most of my money. I'm not crazy about slugs. They're, like, not really incredible at anything. We do get evasion from this one slug. How good is KGB with our engines yet? Uh, honestly, might not be bad. 45 for a slug who's good with the engines? That can be pretty valuable at just ev evading everything. Um, though we do have another store. I kind of want to do a round, like a round trip here. See if there's any good weapons there. Uh, it's going to be tricky, but I doubt we'll get it. Or should I just take something that's good right now? No, I feel like we've been good enough at evading stuff. This is going to make a difference. we got to get a better offense if we want to win the game. Um, let's go depower this thing, and then we will add in... Uh, I'll take one off our evasion, and I'll put it toward a shield, just in case. Okay, we'll go now. We might micromanage that a bit. One shield. At least it's something. It's not going to be very good, but it's something. All that fuel early on really saved us some time. Good offense is a good defense. Yeah, I'm with you on that. See, like here now, we're going to start to deal with this kind of thing. And we don't have any way of getting through this Zoltan shield. Okay, they do have beams. 
Now, honestly, that did pretty well against those. Okay, this is a great ship for us, though, because they their weapons are pretty weak. Great farming, a little bit of experience here. Pewing, okay, and I am... That was very unlucky. I guess I could have micromanaged that a little bit better, but... Ugh, wait, that took down one from our, uh... Oh, no, that's not good. Well, we still got, like, another 13 seconds on this. I'm feeling like it might be more useful to just have you in there. You two go help repair. I need that you on that instead. Uh, don't have enough power. Oh, wait, no, they still haven't repaired it. Okay, shoot the dual lasers. Shoot the dual lasers. Unfortunately, everything is down right now. Power up the mini beam. This is not going to be good for us. We're going to take some damage in this fight. Keep the shields online. Keep the shields online. Stay in there in case if they take our weapons down again, too. Looks like we're not going to be able to avoid that one, either. If we get anything that recharges our stealth, we could basically just stay stealthed all fight. Okay, now we're fine. We're going to win. Big time. Big plays. Big plays. Stealth. Okay, we are dead. Not bad, not bad, but when our weapons went down, we just need better weapons now. Which is usually what you spend most of the run looking for. Uh, oddly enough, we're basically at end game levels of defense, aside from the lack of shields. Like, Drone Swarm would utterly wreck our ship right now. Or like, if we're not stealthed, we're just sitting ducks. That's what makes me kind of freaked out. Like, we'll be super powerful at defending ourselves, and then after that it's just gonna be just a total disaster. Uh, which is obviously bad. I'm thinking if we go one, two, if we see something in the store, we might be able to get a little bit more money here. Not really a very, a very good lineup though this time. I didn't like this galaxy, but we have more uh, civilian ones. Uh, should we just kill these Zoltans? Yeah, let's just fight these Zoltans. I mean, sometimes they'll be nice to you, but, like, you know, you might get something also. Like a prize if you kill them. Uh, prizes for killing. I don't think this is going to make a big difference, but... Man, that weapon pre-igniter is just such a dub. Possible uh, plan for possible stealth system hacks. I do believe that we get some sort of... Um, I mean, if we do get that early on, we're just kind of screwed. Uh, okay, wait a second. I'm going to repurpose power for this, so that puts us at 95% from those flax, because that's a lot of projectiles at once. Cool. Pew, pew. Good. Shields are down. And mini laser. Good. Laser. Okay, now I need my shields back online. Just for a moment. Just for a moment, I think we're gonna take them out though. Cool. Uh, yeah, if they hack us, we're we're dead. I don't I don't uh, have a plan. There's always like some way in which you leave yourself vulnerable in this game. I find, but I guess there's no like perfect plan. To be fair. Okay, cool. Um, hacking would be nice right here. I mean, we don't really have a use for our drone parts. I like a hacking system just because it's an extra thing. Uh, and I mean it puts some use for these, and he's usually fast enough. There is crew here, but we still got the fire suppression. Um, the Zoltan would be useful, but I think hacking is just a more useful system. Uh, and the Zoltan aren't really very good at, like... The thing is, Zoltan, you kind of got to keep them in their positions. Don't get me wrong, like, I've had some ridiculously powerful Zoltans on my ship. But you got to go in hard if you do a Zoltan strategy. Um... Or you get your own Zoltan shield. I'm going to take hacking for now, just because I think it's useful. I like hacking when I can get it. Okay, I'm going to take one off of that. I'm going to put it onto hacking instead. Uh, we'll start to power up our shields again in a moment. I'm trying to figure out if we could even get out of here, though. How far is that? Let me just gauge that with my hands. I think we'll be able to go for one more, come back to the store, then jet our way out of here. So let's j try to explore one more of these. Get a little bit more money out of it. And we went into an asteroid field. That is very unfortunate. Uh, and they are boarding us, too. 
And we can't even really use our hacking either, so let's just put it onto the shields. Uh, oh no, Ryan Secret has also been brainwashed, which means that we are unable to evade completely. Oh no, uh, this was very unexpected. I will send the rock man over though to quell him. Do I just completely lose out on my evade if he is, even when I'm stealthed? Okay, it's a good thing that we have those weapon pre-igniters again. Okay, cool, we got down the Zoltan shield. Good, and then my one level of shield is taking out the asteroids, that's enough. Okay, now they've fired upon us, so now I will stealth. We still get 85% evade, even when our pilot has been brainwashed. I will just beat him into suppression. Okay, now he's fine again. Never mind. He's fine. Ignore that. Okay, and they're all on fire and panicking, but this is the nice part about beam weapons, is that when they do work, they work splendidly. Multiverse? Is there a multiverse mod? I still haven't even yet begun to explore the vast and exciting world of FTL mods. I only play like the vanilla. There's still so much more content. There's like hundreds of hours of enjoyment in this game. It's very fun. Very fun. I was right. Okay, cool. We do have enough room. This is such an unfortunate galaxy shape, but whatever. We just barely don't have enough for... Oh, no. It's actually by quite a lot. Uh, 21, not really even worth it to do any other type of repair. Do we have anything that's worth it? Nah. I don't want to have to get into drone system. I prefer hacking, so I think I'm just going to go. Okay, we'll jet our way out of here. We might be able to visit one more. Multiverse is huge, like triple the content. I, I wish they had created... Like, you know, you know when you want a game company to make more content? Like, yeah, I wish that they would add a DLC to it. I would love that. I would totally support more game development with that. I think we can get one more trip in here. Okay, we got more intruders on board. Ah, uh, I don't really like fighting Zoltans on board my own ship. This is an extremely, like, self-destructive strategy. So if we can just kill their ship before they do anything to us, that would be for the best. I'm going to put the rock man in charge of fighting them. My mantis, I kind of want to keep him back, but... Actually, yeah, leave you on doors. I'll put the rock man in there. Uh, you just get out of that. No, they're in my weapon room too. Okay, you know what? No, never mind. Go to the weapon room. You stay there just so that they don't get through the doors. And I'm actually going to put my engine guy over here. Because this is not a fight I want to risk. I don't want... If they take out our weapons, we're done. We done. Like, for good. Actually, keep those two at bay in this room. And then maybe once they arrive in there, then I'll send the Mantis over to this room to help. This is not going to be very fun for us. Uh, I think I'm just... No, that wasn't even good timing to stealth. Okay, hang on a second. Go like that. Go to the med bay, go to the med bay. This is bad, this is very bad. Okay, you... Go in there, nah. I don't like this combat at all. No, keep it on our shields. Should we just turn off our own oxygen to prevent them from... I guess we could open up the doors here. Honestly, this might be the one fight where we could open up the doors. Let's do this. Yeah, just prevent them from wanting to get out of there. Oh, I could use hacking on their teleport system. Wait, they don't even have a teleport system. How did they do this? Oh yeah, mid bay power, thank you. I think I'm gonna have to take a little bit off our evade. We could deoxygenate ourselves, just we all die if we go. Uh, no, actually, you stay there. I, why did I do this? Why did I do this? Get back on those doors in time. Good, okay. Ah, uh, I don't like this. Yeah, they didn't get out in time. Okay, you gotta get out of there, because those guys are gonna blow up in a second. That's what, the, uh, that's what the Zoltan do. They blow up. Okay, see there? One of them blew up. Yeah, I should have just deoxygenated that room from the very beginning. Oh, wait. I've got the backup battery, too. I forgot about that. Hacking. I could honestly just use hacking here. Yeah, let me go do that. I, I could forego a drone part for this. What should I even disrupt anymore? Uh, we'll go for their shields. 
Just anything we can. We gotta get out of this fight, like, immediately. Okay, go for it now, so that way it'll go down. Take down their what? Ah, oh, Jesus. Another miss? Carneth Corn. I wouldn't really consider myself a pro. Just barely getting by in FTL, but thank you for the kind words. I am not good at this. Okay, now I will stop deoxygenating. I don't want them to just rampantly make their way through our, the rest of our ship. I think we can survive a few of your explosions now. All right, now all we can do is just hope. Okay, cool. Enough of the Zoltans blew up and they didn't destroy our ship, so I think we should be fine. Okay, I'm turning back on my evade. I think now that'll get us through the rest of the fight. You go in here, fight him. They all, just their blowing up always throws me off. I hate it when they blow up. Okay, you can go back out there to help repair too. And it, they might even be trying to escape now. I just got so sidetracked that combat. Everybody go into weapons. We just gotta shoot these people before they get out of here. Good. I hate that. That was so annoying. Decent materials, somewhat worth. So we're pretty vulnerable to getting boarded. It was lucky that they were near the uh, area where I could cut off the oxygen that time, because that, I think, saved me during that combat. I should have seen that when they first boarded, but whatever. Uh, I think a little bit of a door upgrade would be good here, too, in order, because the rock and the mantis aren't bad at fighting either, but... Yeah, that, that was a big spread, and they're, they're kind of deadly, too, you know? The, um... The, whatchamacallit... The, the green glowing people. That's what she said. What, about cutting off your oxygen? What are you doing for fun? Man. I wish I was having that much fun. <laughs> hmm. Alright, I don't think it's worth the drone part that fine. Would be cool. <laughs> Would be really cool. <laughs> Uh, wait a second, why are my weapons not pre-ignited this time? Or were they, and was I just a bit of an ignoramus right there? What did I do? No, they didn't steal my augmentation. Oh, mini beam wasn't powered, my bad. Thank you. Appreciate that. Good eye. Okay, 90% evasion again. Hang on a second. 95. Okay, I think I can get three here. Ah, their shield went back online. Too slow. Too slow. Keep going back for the shield. This is what's going to start to happen to us in these combats, though. We'll be able to less and less reliably get down their shields. Pretty easy, though, when it does work. Pretty easy. We just need some type of offense. Please, God. Some type of offense. Yeah, I keep saving up a lot of money because we just don't have enough weapons. Uh, we could get one power cell potentially, but I don't want to miss out on a, uh, on a good store here or there. I think if we go here, we could... Yeah, we can't get anywhere from here, so we'll go one, two, three... Yeah, we could start to see how much of the rest of this galaxy looks if we do this. Um, willing to make this trade. That basically gives us enough fuel for a long, long time. We still have no use for missiles, so why bother with them if we can't get them? Uh, this ship was prepared to, for an attack. And we'll go in with our laser, laser again. Uh, I don't even think we need hacking this time. Willing to do this. Because we're in an asteroid field, so let's power up the shields. Oh, Jesus, look what are they doing? Unacceptable. Uh, I will take down the weapons system again, though. Ooh, we could get in a nice swath of rooms this time. Actually... Not really. Wait, yes, we can. I'm willing to just go stealth right now. Lasers. Yeah, nobody stands a chance. Why would you board with an NG? And that's not even an essential system. Let's just take down their ship. Ooh, a defense drone. This could be worth some money. Nah, but I don't really think it's a very good offer otherwise. And they're about to die. Yeah. Screw them. Okay, yeah, you stay there. Uh, Mantis, get some combat experience. 
Here we go. This should be a very easy fight for him. And you need to get faster at repairing based on what I just saw in the last combat. Nice. Chain Vulcans with Envies in the module that you can shoot without... Wait a minute, you could do multiple Vulcan guns? When I first tried out the Vulcan gun the last time, I, don't, I can't believe I was playing without that thing before. That's insane. It's so good. It's so ridiculously good, the Vulcan. If we go one, two, punch, then we can blast out of that store and maybe make a lot of money before we get to the next galaxy. This would be very useful. Yes, I like this plan. I... Okay, I'm gonna fight the ship. I More things for us. There may be another way to play this game, but I, I think just straight good things is a perfectly fine way to go through. Let's do this. Ooh, this ship is very vulnerable. No, if we go like this. One, two... Ah, I think I can hit all of these rooms, right? No, I still can't do that. Ah, darn it. Hang on a second. Let me just wait on the mini beam for a second. Okay, it's charging back up. We have to get it in time. Hit the shields especially. Okay, not bad, not bad. Before they hit us with the ion, we stealth mode, boys. Yeah, I was like, do it, but then they also gotta install the rest of the dryer too. And my dryer delivery has gone awry. Oh no, it's the end of the world. A long beam. Yeah, there are... Well, wait a minute. Is the mini beam... Yeah, the long beams in this game are actually ridiculously OP. Like, they will basically just rake an entire ship. But they're also not very good at getting through shields. Oh, whoops. I gotta send you back to your room. Hang on a second. Sync these weapons up, please. Can we sync these weapons up? You've clearly bested us. We clearly request our lives. We merely request our lives. Um, hmm. <laughs> Where? We will not accept surrender. I think we're good. Wait, ah, oh, man, I, I was so full of gaiety at my own... Ah, darn it. They may escape. Okay, it's time to hack. I will begin the hacking now. Okay, hack their, uh, hack their engines. They keep avoiding everything. Honestly, bad. Okay, avoid... Or not even evading, just this is going wrong. Go, Billy Crystal. Good, you have been saved. Uh, breach bomb marked. Ooh, okay, this is a way better thing than what we would have gotten. I think this is going to be a very lucrative store. Hopefully there will be stuff there for us. Like, actually worth getting in it. I would like to go to this distress beacon, but I don't think we'll be able to get back to the store, so I'm going to do it. You clearly are better than us. We request our lives humbly. Oh, uh, this is a great deal. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. Ten fuel for one drone part, that's it. Oh, nice, another store. So if we get bum luck on the first store... Oh, and we got a... Wait, when do we get breach too? Did we just get this? Oh, wait, but that's the teleporting missile. I don't really like teleporting missiles. Oh, burst laser mark two. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, that's so much better than the dual lasers that we had. Um, Dual lasers might not be that bad, though. I'm not really crazy about Breach 2, so I'm going to sell it. I'm going to go ahead and buy Burst Laser Mark 2. Yeah, Dual Laser is one power for two shots, so it is good. Burst Laser Mark 2 is three power for, uh, two power for three shots, so it's also good. Arguably, since we have only three guns, we might want to go with the higher power one. That just gives us more, so I think I'm going to do this. Let's try both of them. That we get way we get five shots. And maybe we'll get a better laser than what we've currently got. Because I'm okay with this. You know, we haven't gotten too many missiles. We aren't going to get the missile augmentation to use up like half as many or whatever it is on the ship. Yeah, let's do it. Burst Laser Mark II. My favorite gun in the game. And we also want to put our high power laser on the higher power lasers on the bottom and then the lower power ones on the top. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Um, whole missile. It requires two power. I'm not crazy about the whole missile, whole missile just in general. It's not my favorite one. We have 38 fuel. We don't need any more of that. I think what we do now is just... Let's do one more jump and see if we get anything crazy at this next door. And then after that, we just buy power after that. Uh, 
In fact, I'm going to save the burst laser just because this strategy is already already working really well for us. Um, let's just see what we get. And then we'll, you know, hopefully get something done at the next place. Then we'll start to be able to invest in the rest of our ship. Yeah, save scrap for upgrading the engine. I mean, it's useless without it. Uh, they pull away from the planet and move into engage. Okay, we're fine. Pew, pew. I think we'll go straight in with the mini beam too, just because we want to use up as much as we can. Or get rid of that Zoltan shield in the way. We might be able to... Hang on a second. We might have to hack these guys. Okay, yeah, it's down. And now we go for their... Let's go for their shields. Can we get four rooms in this? Nah, we can't. Okay, I'll go for engines. Nah, I'll go for guns and shields. Yeah, use the mini beam for that. Oh, darn it, I forgot to... Dang. Uh, we have automatic fire suppression though, right? It's too bad you can't see your own systems in the middle of combat. But yeah, okay, that's definitely the work of automatic fire suppression right there. That was fast. He put that out way too fast. That is what this ship is most vulnerable to, after all. After all. That's its one weak point. Piracy cannot be forgiven, I agree. Yes, attack. Uh, unfortunately, they may escape. Uh, no. Okay, I'm willing to use a drone part. Wait a second, no. Keep the shields online. What am I thinking? Hack their engines. Just for a minute. Don't shoot the mini beam. Hack. Prevent the escape. Do a lasers. On the shields. Then into a noble mini beam on their engines. Good. They will never escape. Uh, 38. Ooh, not bad. Yes, the station appreciates us and gives us their money. Uh, we'll go to the store, just because I, I think we've got enough money right now, and I want to keep exploring. I, I think this is actually a, a weapon strategy that we've got now. Fire suppression we've already got. Uh, I don't really like these ones any better, so yeah, this store is kind of doo-doo. We don't need any fuel, definitely. We don't really need any more missiles, because we just don't have them. The drones will be fine on. Uh, we could fix, but I think instead of fixing, we're at very good health. Let's just start upgrading our ship now. Okay, nice. Um, first things first, I think we get two more weapon points and two more power bars, because we're... I keep forgetting that I have this backup battery. What a dingus I've been. Uh, we will go back like this. So we get a huge burst of lasers and then the mini beam. And then I think... Might be nice to have one more dedicated power. Uh, you return to your post. If they're escaping, it shows on top of the ship. I always miss that. Thank you for reminding me of that. The, the beam weapon powered when we jump in for the pre-ignite. Yeah, I, I think we can do better with our beam weapon. I think we can get one really big weapon too here because the dual lasers and burst laser mark two are good. It might not be bad to have a missile, but I like the beam. Maybe something instead of dual lasers, too. Just the three weapon slots kind of throws me off. I prefer four greatly. Um, we could buy more shields if we want to, really. Although I feel like that's kind of a cop-out. Yeah, we want to get our evasion totally up for these fights. Let's go ahead and just get our evasion back. I don't want our evasion to always depend on backup power, so let's go to... Um, we'll do that. I think I'm just going to buy another power because that's pretty cheap. The last one at 25. Return crew to positions. Maybe I'm going to get another pilot space here too the, with, for the fi auto 50% evasion because when he got mind controlled before, that was pretty rough. That's a pretty necessary upgrade. Uh, I'm not too worried about the door situation just because we got the automatic fire suppression now. I'm thinking I'd like to do two on here but I still don't really have the power to support it. So let's just keep, we're gonna keep buying power. Um, here we see Rebel Scout again. Man, just that weapon pre-igniter is so good. I think we go everything in for shields 
Just totally wreck the shield room. Oh, wait a minute. We don't even... I don't even think we need to hack right now. We're fine. We're fine. Don't even need my backup power, really. Yeah. Screw it. Dang. That's good. Dang. Mm, okay, their missile is powering up. We'll wait until they've shot it. But yeah, they're totally... Like, they got their priorities all off. Let's let him get a little bit of combat experience, too. Missile is out. Shields are up. We're at 95% evade. I think that's about as well as we're going to do. Actually, I would have been kind of worried that guy got hit by a missile. Okay, let's turn on backup power. Uh, we'll send over our Mantis friend. Hey, Mantis friend. Wow, we got a lot of scrap from that fight. That's going to be useful. Okay, we'll put that onto the med bay. And now you both go in for some health care. <sighs> smashing, smashing. I didn't think that this run would be going this well. I mean, after our last one, I did have one with horrible RNG at the very start. You can't do horrible RNG at the very start of this game. You could do it later on, but it just snowballs. This is a very lucky run, you're right. Like, after our horrible luck, it got way better. I'm thinking we could go one, two, three, four. That'll work for this. Uh, do we want more... I feel like we're stupid powerful for this sector already. I'm just trying to think of what else I would even do. What happens if we, if we encounter somebody with more shields? Now, let's just try to keep doing what we got. Save up our money so that we can make a big decision next so that we get ready for endgame. Okay, we got an extra gun now. We got the uh, Ion Stunner. Only requires one power. I don't really like st Stunning Crew, though. It just doesn't have anything to do. We'll just use it for money later on. Potentially more shields for asteroid combat. That's a good idea. See, now, okay. Here we go. These guys don't want to fight. They're going to escape. But even still, I think we'll be able to get through. E even still... Let's prepare our backup power, though, for a potential hack if we have to. Okay, see, now we've got the mini beam ready. This ship is just very vulnerable. Was this the ship where I could get four systems at once? I'm not even going to try it. Let's just go for three. When we get a better laser, we'll try it. Okay, now they've teleported to us. I didn't really expect that. I think if we go stealth mode when they attack, uh, no, send in my rock. Rock. Man, they're never even going to get a chance to, like, shoot us. Pew, pew, pew. Okay, now they just shot us. Good. I mean, not good that they shot us, but good. We've been shot again. I love it when they do that. Ooh, 45 scrap. That's a nice heap of it. Yes, a generous, a generous sum of scrap. Yeah, the shield upgrades will become more vital as we go. You're right. I think for right now, though, if... Because like, shields, we can just do at any time. I'm thinking of what could cause our untimely doom, though. 212. Eh... I always regret spending scra uh, scrap, though. I always feel like I just don't have enough of it. Yeah, we're totally fine for these combats right now. Maybe at the danger of uh, of potentially being guilty of hubris, I will continue in my ways. Here we are. Uh, uh, we will go in with the... Uh, keep shooting the shields, and then let's go for the... We could just probably kill the entire enemy crew at this rate. Man. Yeah, you know, the dual lasers will go for their gun. There's so much we're not even utilizing on this ship yet. Whoops. I forgot to stealth. It, never mind. I mean, we won the combat already. I'm finally good at FTL. I, I mean, I know we've been horribly lucky. I know when to quit, and I know when to... Uh, board the station and look for survivors. Revenue are damaged and dilapidated. 
faint life signatures. I feel like we have a pretty good sized crew. Let's just scrap the debris. Nice, 58. That was sweet. Okay, let's jump to the next sector because there's really no danger there. Now, we did get through all the... Oh, cool, I got an achievement. On a wing and a prayer, get to sector five without repairing. Nice. No stores nearby. I think you're right. I think we got to invest in some shields now. All right, what do we go for next? We're probably going to need more weapon systems, like, before the end, or just a better laser, honestly. I would be pretty bummed if I got, like, a good laser in an upcoming store and I didn't have enough money for it. So let's go ahead and just do, like, maybe... Maybe one shield upgrade. What would this cost us? We'd still be at 181. You know, what I could do would be double up on shields. We're still at 241. That's very respectable. And then we use backup power for our shields. Itachi12451 also. Thank you very much for the prime. Might be free crew or lose. Yeah, that was what I, was tr what I thought was tricky. Is like You could get free crew or it could be like, ah, somebody gets kidnapped and you lose them. Like, without ever even getting to go through the combat. I think we go one, then two, to just see about our options. Actually, we could see everything from here. Let's go here. Get to find out if there's an early store. Um, Choose your doom. Oh, yeah, we have to fight them. Uh, Slug ships are probably the easiest ones to go after, right? Okay, now we will turn on backup power, turn on our shields. Look, we're just going to wreck their ship with, like, one barrage. If we just do that. Wait a second. Oh, wait on that one, actually. Who just leveled up? Ooh, gun level two. Ooh. I guess the fear is, like, what if... Oh, we also have a shield system and we have no one on it for, like, the last... How did I completely miss that? I feel so bad. Uh, oh, wait a minute. I I just messed up horribly. It's okay. A lot of things occurred to me at once. I am a, a bit of a small brain. Sorry if you were shouting that at me and I didn't see it. I apologize for being an ignoramus. Or just not even an ignoramus, just unaware and confused. Okay, cloaking. This ship has so many systems from the beginning, though, that it is tricky to, like, figure out what you're even supposed to be doing. These guns are great. Nice! That's tons... Jesus Christ, that's so much scrap. How did we get this lucky? This The last, like, four runs were not this good. This is gonna be an easy dub. Uh, required power three. Nah. Breach... Breach is pretty cool. But I like our lasers. I do like our lasers. Like, these guns that we have are just so good. I will sell my Ion Stunner, though. I could sell it and then maybe use it later. If we got another Burst Laser Mark II, I think that would be even better, just because I could do with the extra power. That's fine. Hmm. You feel like a dingus yourself, too? Hmm. Yeah, I think upgrading the engine at this point. I just don't think that was that good a start. Nothing that really shouts at me in terms of combat. Uh, we could go here, then here, then here. All right, I think I, it's time to... Yeah, we're really not a very shield-heavy strategy. Let's go ahead and upgrade our ship. We don't really have enough power on stuff. Let's go with... Yeah, I think engine would be good. You're right. But also shields. Go for another door if we wanted. Uh, also oxygen. I think just buy the next level of oxygen. Be just because if, if something happens to your oxygen and your whole ship, everybody dies. It, it's not fun. Uh, as I always say. Let's go for another thing of power. Yeah, two more things of power. That way we can always have another shield online. Look, it gets even more blue and intense. Did it? Wait a minute. Unf oh, it does. It gets brighter blue and more intense. Happier and with your mouth open. Uh, let's go ahead and do... We could do a third shield and just be so untouchable here. But yeah, I feel like that at that point it's just missiles. 
Let's go for the extra evade. And then the final evade is usually not worth it. Although, what if we get something really good in this galaxy? Like another store in two seconds. See, I don't really feel like I need those engines. So I'm going to keep saving my money a little bit longer here. And then I think we go for here. Because there's got to be one more store nestled in there. And I just don't think we need the extra uh, defense right now. I think we're fine. Yeah. I hate to say it, but... It is what it is. Double shields is, is plenty for right now. Um... Everything is a trap. Okay. Just, when in doubt, don't do it in this game. Because so many of the events just kill your crew. Uh, like, that you put so much invest in, in, into. Okay, this should be fine. Um, my colony seems to have recently attacked. Exploring the... Uh, invite him to join your crew? Oh, cool, we got Charlie. Engine man. Engine man. Okay, great. So that's basically a free power. Um, you, it's not. It's never good to rely on NGs. Well, you need someone supporting them with combat, but it is what it is, again. It would be nice to have the human in that room. Oh, well. I mean, you're good with the engine, so that basically gives us a free power, and you're good at it, so it's more dodge. Uh, I'll take it. Okay, now we can permanently power up our hacking. Don't really need the med bay. Save crew positions. Another free crew. Okay, I need a secret-themed... Um, Zoltan crew named when you think of it maybe like secret boy secret boy we don't have a secret boy on the ship usually we've had secret boy interfere and save the uh let's help the Zoltan ship I would rather fight Zoltan than Mantis hmm. secret I like it no, I can't rename him now I will rename him after the fight that's a good name. It's a respectable name. Okay, we're already being pelted with asteroids. Uh, mm, I will send my mantis to fight yours. Why would you go to the med bay? <laughs> Idiot. Uh, hmm. All right. Uh, hmm. Beams. Uh, we aren't ready with our beams yet. Hang on a second. Man, they're being pelted with asteroids in this. This is great. Okay, good. Eight. Oops, I stealthed slightly too soon. Hey, rare truck. Thank you very much for the two months. Eight, indeed. Hey, eight. What are we talking about? I, I know it was an emoji. I just think it's funny what TTS does. Man, we are stupidly overpowered in these fights. Jesus Christ. Look at me go. Okay, we will jump again. Uh, unfortunately, no stores. Let's go see if we can find one over here, though, because we are, yeah, indeed, we are sitting on a lot of scrap, and it just seems like a waste to not use it. You know, we could sustain more hull damage if we aren't powered up enough. Okay, apparently it wasn't a real distress signal. This happened to me the other day. I think... I may have accidentally butt-dialed an emergency number. I'm not sure, because I think they're just like, it's all right. But how do they tell with those things? Why is my stealth off? Oh, they ionized me. Disgusting. I'm fine. This is the best. This might be one of the best ever runs I've had in this game. Insane. Let's go ahead and see over here if there is one more. St we can't even get to it if it's a store here. Uh, uh, I'm thinking we go like do 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 something like that, because these ones aren't going to yield a store for us. We have 338. I just want to exhaust all my options in case if there's a store. Participate in the study and receive 27 scrap. Ah, uh, okay, no store. At least I can upgrade my ship and feel good about it then. Mr. National Parks. Also, thank you very much for the Prime. Eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. uh, I love stealth now after this whole run. It's really good. It's really worth it. We could just totally upgrade the reactor if we want. This is useless to upgrade, in my opinion. Um, this is cool to upgrade, but it doesn't make a big difference. Blast doors could be useful here just because I don't like people moving around my ship too much. And when I get somebody off those doors, 
I think I will do that. I think we can also upgrade the engine. Uh, we'll do that. That's basically free power there. I have more power than I need. I mean, we'll just use that for the backups. Keep that powered. Yeah, and 130 is not bad to sit on. I think two shields is plenty as well. Save the crew positions. I don't know if I did that there. Um, one, two... I could always just make a quick escape for the exit. Let's go one, two, see if we can get into three, and then four. I think we're going to just have to go one, two, three, though. Yeah, I mean, we're hardly even using our stealth. It's like we haven't even used the first line of defense, and we have, like, three more lines of defense. I almost want to get into a more difficult combat just to see how it goes, because our laser... I think we could play against the final boss right now and survive, but I... I think we could do a little bit better. Like, I always see these crazy offensive runs on YouTube, and I want to put one of them together. But just look how quickly we totally incapacitate the enemy ship. That's insane. Like, we could go take out the crew if we wanted instead. Uh, I don't think that's a very good offer. Oh my gosh! We just got a free chain Vulcan? What? That's insane! That's so crazy! <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's so powerful! Wait, does it? Ooh. Man, I wish I had a fourth one. It's pre-ignited. I gotta just check it out to see what it does. I, I just want to shoot a barrage of missiles at them. Now, keep in mind, I really like what I've already got, but it might only charge up one of its um, sections of power. Now I feel like, okay, this is like an end game gun. Jesus, this is a stupidly powerful run. Three. Okay, I'll get two more so we can put the Vulcan down here. And then can we power... No, we can't if we do that. We have to power it like that. Uh, oh, no, we don't have enough power for that either. Okay, we'll take off one power from there and we'll turn on... Eh, let's take one off there and we will power up our burst laser. Okay, dual lasers we might not have... This might be a full weapon power run. Oh, I wish that we had four weapon slots. This is crazy. I'm not sure if we get all four charges on it, though, but that is quite crazy if it does work. Okay, let's try this. This might be one of the most powerful ships I've ever had. Okay, Vulcan is currently at what power level? Okay, nope, it pre-ignites only one regular boy amount. So this is, like, okay. It's not amazing. This is also a very powerful ship we're going against. And I'm experimenting with weapons here. Okay, I gotta avoid that flak missile. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hang on a second. Okay, unfortunately, we avoided all of that flak. That is ridiculously powerful. The Vulcan shoots only one, but now we're at plus five Vulcan. Shields are almost totally down. Okay, shields are completely down. We gotta bring their weapons offline before another uh, flak barrage. Jesus Christ, the Vulcan is so good. Imagine two Vulcans. Oh, awesome. I'm not sure if it's really at the... This is definitely final boss ready. But we'll see how we do next. Um, yeah, okay, we have room for one more. It makes us slightly weaker at the very beginning of the fight, but way stronger as we go. I'm willing to... Actually, I don't even think we need to do this. We aren't even missing five health. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I think we're missing only four. Nah, because I can just save my... Yeah, I can just ignore that. Famous last words. Yeah, in case an event heals me, like I don't want to, I don't want to uh, miss out on it. You know, it's a good point. Okay, we'll go in with the burst laser and the Vulcan again. Now, do those fire simultaneously? No, we're good. That's fine. I just need one more power because I want to do uh, this burst laser. Ooh, I don't want them to board. So wait till the last second, and then oh, I don't want to get hit with that flak either. But yeah, I really don't want them to board us because that throws me off. I mean, it's gonna happen. Okay, backup power. I will actually use a drone part here. See if we can um, hack their drone system before they get anything done there. We have such a generous amount of time from our stealth. 
It's like insanity, but we'll wait until our cloak heals, uh, wears off. One more. Okay, now I'll hack it. Their drone goes haywire. Okay, now Vulcan shoot their engines, and... Man, you could just target anything you want at any time, that's crazy. This is why we got that autopilot. This is what we asked, this is what we needed. Uh, you go in there, you're not gonna be very good at repairing though, but... Yeah, that dude is screwed. <laughs> uh, fortunately those not weapons, so we won't prevent them from getting away. Uh, that's not a very good offer. I'm not gonna accept this. Hmm? Jesus. Fortunately, we avoided that last one, too. Okay, slightly better. We did better. I think it was worth it. I think this might be the best ever run of FTL. The goat. Yeah, we need more weapon power. A little bit more. Good call. Good call. Now we got 40. Uh, I will put a little bit more into that. And now we... Jesus. That's a huge burst of... One, two, three, four, five, six shots right away. And then on top of that, you've also got... Um, oh, whatchamacallit. Five shots immediately, and then followed by one that accelerates. The only thing is that the Vulcan isn't fully charged, but that would basically just be a win right there if the Vulcan were fully charged immediately. But we don't have any more friendly sectors. I think that's the last of our big luck. Yeah, only go for the burst laser mark two dream. I do like the mini beam, though, but it's not as specific in targeting. It's not good at getting through shields, so I w I'm going to avoid that one. Okay, this is a pretty great galaxy. Uh, I'll go back one, and then up. I mean, a store at this point is pretty much useless to me. I'm not gonna... I guess we'll just snake around. Never mind. Why am I getting so lucky? <laughs> Why am I this... I was never, like, it's the same difficulty as we've been playing on. Uh, I will attack the... Ooh, we haven't fought a Lanius ship yet. Eh, I'll just... I'll fight the Lanius. The Lanius are very, very strong, though. Keep that in mind. Uh, they These people have three shields, but we also are at the beginning of a new sector. Oh, you've... This was clearly the wrong guy to mind control. I think the only issue here is we don't have any shield experience because we've just not had to use it. We have Lanius boarding our ship. I don't like that at all. Uh, wait a minute. You stay there. This is actually a rough fight. They've mind controlled like half of our crew. Uh, shield boy, I don't really need the shields, so why don't you just stay in there? Two Lanius in one room is pretty rough. Let's see if we can fight them both in our shield room. This is kind of rough. Uh, no, don't fight them alone. It's dangerous to go alone. Their entire ship is deoxygenated. Uh, I think we gotta hack their mind control, just cause... Oh wait, why did I do that? Ugh, yikes. Whatever, I already clicked it, I can't undo it. Live with my mistake. Open the doors to keep the oxygen balanced. Oh, like, as it fills into different rooms? <laughs> I don't think I know how to do that. Or should we just go straight for... Let's just go straight for their shields, because we got to take them down. Wow, we didn't fully take down their shields. That is surprising. Uh, I will then shoot their... I'll hack their engines, because that was a lot of misses. Like a surprising number of misses. Just about ready for another barrage now. Okay, we'll hack it. Good, that means zero dodge. Zero dodge. Uh, ooh, these Lanius are tricky to deal with. Okay, I'm gonna go back into the med bay for a minute. We take down one of these. Man, they have good weapons too. This is a very respectable ship. Go in for one more on their shields. Man, that shield room is not going down. Who cares if they destroy our shields though? Okay, now their shields are fully down. 
Go in. Go for their guns. Ah, yikes. We just took some damage. Man, when was the last time that we took hull damage? And they have stealth on their ship, too. Ah, they got my engine boy down, too. Yikes. This is a rough fight. This is not good. I forgot that Lanius were this strong. Did they kill their own people? Okay, we just killed one of their guys. But they still have that flak gun for another second, and they're dead. That was a very difficult fight, but we were also very handsomely rewarded for it. All we need to do is repair our hull anyway. We just get a store or another easy event. That won't be too bad. Yeah, they had good guns on that ship. I think I just got thrown off by their crew boarding. Might be nice if... I don't think we have any room for another system. I'm pretty sure that we can't get mind control in here, but... Yeah, mind control is pretty rough when it hits you. <laughs> mind control is actually pretty rough. Uh, I think hacking the engine was the right move, though. Just because they had good evade on their ship, too. That was what was unseen. So if we go over here, then we get a good view of the stores. I think I'll keep snaking along throughout the galaxy. 192, though. Ah, uh, what do I do? Turn off hacking. We're going to start to see more three, three pip shields, though. I think that ship was particularly strong for this, uh, for this sector, though. Okay, blue event, take it. Um, alright, I'll see how many stores are here. 243. Might give us enough for something good. Uh, okay, every... Th you know, maybe this is a waste, though. Let's try three. Can we, like, always use a robot from now on? Let's go ahead and just hack their ship. I'm gonna go ahead and hack the, uh, the engine really quick. Okay, now... Power it on so that they can't dodge. Go straight in for the shields. That way, Burst Laser Mark II basically gets the shields down. And a Vulcan shot. And then we shoot dual lasers at their weapons just to take those offline. Because this looks like it could be nasty. Look, two pikes if they manage to ionize their shields. Because those things don't miss. Come on, I can't even keep track of it. Yeah, I'll just go stealth mode. Not even trying now. How could they possibly escape? <laughs> ah, we prevail. I want to have one of those ships for myself. Like a, a pirate slug ship. Yo ho, yo. You know, you know, I could sing sea shanties. Have a good time in space. Uh, no store. I'm just thinking to myself, do I even need a store for anything anymore? Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe there's no store required here. We could max out our engines this time. Get insane dodge. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, let's get a little bit more power. I'm always going to use more power for whatever I do. So, we'll take it. Nice. The space... Yes, not sea shanties. Space shanties, of course. How could I say that? If I go over there, then I get the option of seeing these ones. Ah, uh, we'll do that. Yeah, mind control would be nice. Uh, never dock with them. Just hail them and... Di yeah, there's always evil afoot. I think, again, we go in for the hacking on the engines, because just we had too many of those lasers missed the last time. Okay, they're going to go for our backup battery. That's basic we'll just power it on in case if we can get some juice out of it. Basically useless, though. You know, I'm not even going to camouflage for it, because I'd rather avoid their weapons. Those weapons are really good, and we want to avoid that first salvo. That's fine. Totally fine with that. Ours comes in on theirs. We hack. We hit their shields. Cool. Shields are down. Now we go in for their weapons. Ah, uh, let's just shoot everything. Okay, and then we go stealth mode as soon as they shoot their guns. Stealth mode. 103% dodge, that's sure. Nice. Cool. Okay, they're dead. They're dead, Lanius. 
It seems tricky to play as a Lanius ship, because what if you get other crew? Like, you have to segment off your ship. I would rather just have a whole ship full of Lanius. Ooh, nice store here. Good. Uh, okay. Uh, unfortunately, there is no mind control. That's too bad. Uh, might not be bad to have a repair boy. Giles is good, but not really worth it. Um, Steven Dengler. We don't have any NGs on our crew, and NGs, I think, are pretty great. He's also got good repair skills, so this guy is basically just like a free repair on whatever system. I, I think that would be good, because if they do take down our weapons, we're in trouble. So I think I'm willing to buy Steven Dengler. <laughs> Dengler. Uh, I'm going to keep him there. Maybe with our Zoltan, too, because he looks a little bit vulnerable back there. But I like him in this central location, just in case if anything goes awry. Quadrangle. Well, yeah, what is a secret name for... I just like the name Steven Dengler. Oh, yeah, Charlie. Yeah, sorry, I forgot to rename him. He is... Uh... Secret. There we are. Secret. Hmm. Oh, the O2 is off. Oh, Jesus Christ, what have I done? Thank you. I was like, why is it getting so pink in here? No, we don't need oxygen. Entire crew dies. Hmm. Okay, what is our oxygen at? We'll just wait until the oxygen fully refills. Hang on a second. Let me double up on oxygen. We don't really need the second oxygen bar. It's just that we want it to be able to go to orange before it goes to red if it ends up getting shot in the fight. Uh, okay, we will save the crew positions. Dangler. Okay, I'm more willing to do another store rather than two more random events. Just because if we... The stores are just so good. I, you know I like them. Unfortunately, we didn't find any of the things I want. It's a little late for a scrap recovery arm. And this is kind of useless. I'm just going to go ahead and fix... I could fix, like, maybe three. I'm going to do that just so that we get a little bit more health... Okay, now what do we do? I want three levels of shields for this ship because I don't like going in the bo final boss fight without all my shields. So I think I'm just going to start putting money into shields now. Uh, not bad, not bad. This is looking like an end game ship now. Three blue shields. I think we could go for a fourth, although it's not our main strategy at this point. It starts to catch up with us, you know? Like, uh, there comes a time when a man needs a shield. Okay, I could go here. Good idea. Buy, time to buy some replacement bot uses. Like, what kind of bot? Hmm. For a moment. Okay. Engine. And then we will get Vulcan ready. Eh, you know, we'll just start shooting Vulcan at them so that it can start lowering its cooldown. Yeah, nice. Okay, now we hack. And then we just shoot all of our burst lasers at them, and then maybe we'll shoot Vulcan at the weapons. Cool. All right, this is a decent attack pattern. No, we got to shoot Vulcan at the shields again. It doesn't really make a difference. Whatever it is, it's just going to take it down. Okay, pew, pew, and do I just avoid the missile? Yeah, I'm okay with this because we now have three. Let's let our shield guys get some experience. We'll just stealth for um, rockets now. Man, geez, nobody can get away. Uh, huh. Okay, cool. Not even really being very specific in my targeting now. Okay, now I will stealth because I am afraid of that thing. Uh, don't accept surrender and woo woo. Okay, uh, only one more power upgrade available. That is rather unfortunate because I, I'm in one of those runs where I, I feel like I could use even more power, and there's no other escaping here, so we'll just have to go straight to the exit. Yeah, upgrading the backup battery, that is true. Uh, no, I don't want to sell my drone parts. I want them for my, uh, for my hacking. I'm actually more willing to go to pirate control rather than a slug nebula. I hate nebulae, and I hate slugs. Although, <laughs> mind control. It is an interesting strategy, isn't it? Yeah, you can see a Zoltan in the shop. Uh, NG crew to calm down. I think NG crew is good here, yeah. 
Cool. Distress. Uh, I think again we snake around, although there's really no escape from this side. So let's go over... You know, we're just going to spend our time going like this. It'll probably be like... Noom, noom, noom. Noom, noom, noom. Something like that. Let's try this. Yeah. I, too, hate them. Uh, and tempt to... You know, I want to fight them, so we will just never surrender one of our crew. Yeah, we'll just attack them. I don't even want to use... I don't want to escape. I want to fight you. <laughs> uh, let's even... Let's just see if we even need hacking at all for this fight. Yeah, look at all those misses. That's why I'm like... Uh, you know, although we don't really need it... I feel like it wouldn't hurt to use a couple of drone parts. But, uh, they don't have anything that good. Yeah, let's just try that. We'll avoid that burst laser mark three, though. That scares me. Yeah, that thing is huge. Five shots. Don't play around with that. Ooh, this is a good crew member. How many... What is our max, though? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I believe that we can get eight. Zass is pretty good. Yeah, I think that this is our last crew member. Okay, I want another repairman. Only because, what if something goes awry in the back of the ship? We have a repairman at the front, but I think having another one and a human. Humans are pretty versatile. I'm willing to take that. Ooh, I will name him after one of my favorite characters from all of video gaming. Uh, I'm going to name him Fixer after Star Wars uh, Knights of the Old Republic. Um, or no, 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 sorry. Wrong, wrong one. Star Wars Republic Commando. Republic Commando, that was the game. You know, where you'd like, do all the cool stuff and you command the squad. It's one of our favorite games. Uh, I think if we go around like this, then we go to the store and come back this way. That's the best bet here. Make a lot of... I know it's not as secret, but... Uh, hang on a second. Yeah, I will never surrender. I will never surrender, obviously. Why would they even ask? Yeah, I don't even think we need... Until we get more drone parts, I just want to be ready for the final battle. Forget about it. Hmm. Hey, Angie Butt. Thanks for coming out. Hope you enjoy the stream. Wait a sec. Ooh, I was like a second too late there. Feeling kind of stupid right now. All right, we'll go for the weapons and the shields and stuff. Ooh. This person is actually really good, only because whoever it was that we had on shields, I believe it was Billy Crystal. And this would actually allow us to get a fourth thing of shields. This is a crew. Yeah, I'm going to take them only because we haven't even had a chance to power up our shields. Because we've never even had to use them. I'm going to take this. Billy Crystal? Because look at how bad at Billy Crystal is with the... <laughs> I never thought I would be saying this today. Um, Billy Crystal is really not too particularly good with our shields. Because he just hasn't even had a chance to practice them. But this person is fully into shields. 30% faster, which is insane. So we're going to go ahead and dismiss... Billy Crystal, uh, and we will keep, we will accept that, and touring, sorry, you won't really be missed, but, you know, hate to see you go, uh, we will rename you Billy Crystal, uh, number two, uh, Billy, sorry, Billy Crystal, uh, number two, or, like, Mark Two. No, it's going to make it the second name if I do it like that. Okay, so it still looks like Billy Crystal, but, you know, you sort of look like him, so we'll keep you on our ship. Uh, I still believe we have a store to see. I don't think there's much else that I would want to add a store, but... Uh, 140. Let's see what they have. I doubt I'm going to get anything here. I'm just going to go now. Because I would rather just spend the money on other stuff. Nope, nope. Uh, mind control. Good. Uh, are we able to fit another system? If we are, this is actually useful because it prevents us from having just absolute chaos. Uh, and our crew is now weaker because we don't have the rock crew. Um, we could buy the Zoltan crew. Like, dismiss one of ours to get, uh, another one. 
think uh, I want the mind control here, definitely. Yeah, I'll take it as my ship's final system slot. Uh, not a bad point. Let's go ahead and just see. I'm liking these. I think we could probably sell the mini beam. I don't think I'm going back to it anytime soon. Um, yeah, I'm going to sell it. I don't need it. I don't really have much of a use for it. Just my other ship's lasers are good enough. Uh, hmm. I want to look at the upgrading here. So if we get one more power... I've got to power up that mind control, after all. We could get a fourth layer of shields. That would be really nice. We don't need to have this powered most of the time, so that gives us one more power. Um, one more would give us enough for shields. I think we'll be okay without the other Zoltan. Because I'm trying to think, where would I put him on to? Yeah, you got to be using him to power up some other system, and I currently like the all the systems that I've got powered up. I've got one on the shields. I've got one on the engines. That's fine. So I think we just buy one more power normal boy. And then we get the two more shields after this. Cool. So right for right now we can put that on mind control in this. Mind control is fun just to use it as like a distraction, but we don't really need it very much right now. I think now we just snake around till the end. Let's just make sure where can we even get out from? Ooh, this is a tricky one. We'll have to get out from this node. Okay, I'll snake around over here. Um, stealth we're pretty good on. I like stealth. Uh, fire a warning shot. Cool. I don't know how that really made us better in the combat, but whatever. So be it. Uh, mind control on... Oh, our s mind control has been blocked, unfortunately. And when they have the Zoltan shield, they're actually very strong. Okay, cool. It is time for mind control. And... Uh... Gets get their pilot so that they can't evade, assuming that they don't have any autopilot. When that breach missile comes through... Okay, now I'm stealthing. This is the best ship I've ever had in this game. I don't even need my backup power. Look at that thing. I wouldn't want to have wanted that to hit the ship. How could I, how could I let that happen? It takes a lot for this to work, though. Jeez. Okay, now there we go. All right, one, two... And I guess three will keep firing at the shields, sort of. Man, we could just kill the crew at this rate. Jesus. This is so good. Uh, all right. Yeah, I'll take more shields. 108. Whoops. Undo. Until we get the both of them at the same time. Um, Thinking one, two, three. It just doesn't really matter here. Dangler in the mind control room. Oh, wait a minute, would he, uh, uh, I don't think we get any bonus if there's somebody manning the mine. Could we don't get another level of it, do we, like we do with these subsystems? So I think I'm going to leave him up here. Dengler is just there in case if someone hits that part of the ship, honestly. It's a little bit useless right now, but, like, if somehow our gun room gets hit, it will come in handy. Oops, are they fully, oh, no, they're not fully charging their eye on. Never mind. I doubt they'll be able to get through us, though. Man, the mind control is unfortunately useless here. Alright, just start shooting their weapons. Go, Vul man, Vulcan is just such a pew. <sighs> That's nice. 155. Uh, I'm gonna have to pay 180 for the last bit of shields, so let's avoid that for now. Okay, we can kind of mosey our way along here, 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 and here. We'll avoid that other one. Mind control my own crew for fun. Uh, you can remind control. Remind control. <laughs> remind control. When you forget things and I prevent you from uh, whatever. Uh, okay, mind control their pilot. Totally take away their evade. Man, we have, like, multiple ways of taking away all of their evasion. That's insane. Ooh, okay, they've shot at us. Uh, no. No, not good enough. Not good enough. We demand blood. <laughs> Ooh, we're killing their crew. Man, look at this. 
We're just doing damage we don't even intend to do to their ship. I do believe that's a pretty OP way to go about the campaign. Like, if you can leave the enemy ship intact by boarding, I think you get a lot of extra stuff. Like, you might not get crew per se, but we did a run like that with the Mantis once, and it was insanely good. Stupid powerful. Oh, whoops, I could have gotten another shield there. I totally forgot. It's all right. Whatever, we'll just ignore that. Um, unfortunately, you know, mind control in this fight. Honestly, the fact that they have a drone is making me a little bit worried. Yeah, I'm already down to one shield. I'm just going to stealth right now because I'm a little bit scared. Pew, pew. Okay, their shields are not going down fully, like, very easily. Okay, asteroids doing their work here. Okay, just go straight for the guns now. I just, I don't want to get shot. Okay, nice. Just, oh man, it's like a continuous launching of missiles. It's like a practically a totally different game. How are we getting so much scrap in this run? That's insane. Okay, we can't buy right now. We'll go one, two, and three. If only we had a fourth weapon slot, this would be so good. We have 39 missiles we can't do anything with. It just ignore, we aren't even using missiles in this run. Not that it makes a difference, I don't need 31 fuel. Okay, just take the fuel. Ooh, do I use it? Burst laser mark three, I know it's not. Wait a minute, do I even have enough power first off? Required power four and it shoots only five. This is really not that good a gun. But do we have the... No, we don't even have it. Nah, this is not even worth it. Yeah, Burst Laser 3 is worse than 2. It's it's an awful gun. Oh, well. That's unfortunate. If it had been a Burst Laser Mark 2, we could have used it. We could have taken the last weapon slot. That would have been the ultimate, like, laser build. Yeah, we'll do shield upgrade instead. Cool, there we go. Uh, What else do we have? We can take power off the mid bay and probably the mind control for a while. We'll use that only some of the time. I think in the meantime, we can get uh, higher dam. Uh, let's get the free systems. Let's go ahead and buy the backup power. Actually, do we even need more backup power? Seems like kind of a waste now. I think I'd like to upgrade my mind condition. Yeah, now we're just on to end game powers. Nice. <laughs> we already have some backup battery. Okay, we'll explore an asteroid field. We have four shields for Pete's sake. Ooh, ballistophobia. Six hull points repaired. Nice. We got ballistophobia. Um. Because we didn't fire any missiles in this entire campaign. That is quite cool. Uh, we don't even need a repair, so let's just go ahead and fight a bunch of enemy ships. Okay, aha. Uh, yeah. Alright, I have 13 drone parts. I can start using my hacking every single fight now. And we'll turn on the backup battery. Let's mind control and hack them at once. Mind control the pilot and then hack the engines. <laughs> Man, these guys really made a mistake this time. Look, we have the faithful human there, or the basically meat shield NG. Nice. Okay, now I think we could go in on the weapons with that. Willing to take a hit from the shields. Good, we got a little bit more dodge ability. Uh, yeah, I like those systems we're targeting right now. Cool. Okay, we avoided the missile. Man, look at that. It just... Ah, rips apart the enemy ship. That is nice. Ooh, another store. I'm not even sure I've ever seen this before. Maybe I could trade away my, like, laser? I don't know. Yeah, let's go check it out. I'm not even sure I've ever had it. A... I think there... Oh, whoops. Thank you. I should have healed the NG. Yeah. Burst laser mark one. Required power two, shots per charge two. That's not even as good as dual lasers though, is it? That's odd. Hmm. 
Hang on a second. Uh, required power two, shots per charge two. Is that even as good as my dual lasers? Normal damage one, charge time 10 seconds. Wait a second. 11 seconds? This is like objectively worse than dual lasers. It's, yeah, it's just strictly a worse gun in every possible way. Okay, it is not good. Uh, shield charge booster. Man, there's so many other things I would like to do. I feel like fire suppression isn't maybe so useful for us anymore. Could we get a different augmentation? Crew take half damage from low oxygen or battery charger. Backup batteries lock time is halved. Oh yeah, thank you. I got a cell burst three. Appreciate that. Uh, hmm. 15% faster shield boost. Yeah, I'm feeling like emergency respirators is pretty good. My fear is when they attack our ship with the mind control. Yeah, everybody's saying shield booster. I'm saying fire suppression goes out because we got a big crew now, so we don't really need it anymore. And then I'm saying we take shield charge booster. That seems the most useful. Uh, the rest of it... Oh, Jesus, 40 fuel. We're fine. Okay, now I can spend the rest on us. So let's go ahead and get... These are systems that don't require power. I'm thinking that to be able to make somebody on the enemy ship really powerful would be good. Like, if we could mind control someone really well... That's stupid OP. So let's go ahead and do that, and then we'll buy a better backup battery just to power that system, because that's way too much power that we don't want on it most of the time. Um, there appears to be a fight over there. It looks like it's going to take this guy a little while to get over here, though. So I say we go one, two, maybe even three, and then fight them over there. Yeah, we'll be fine. Oh, dang, I forgot to heal him again. That's okay. Dengler is... Dengler is a strong boy. Okay, we'll put him there. Uh, turn enemies into friendlies temporarily. Yeah, that's gonna be stupid good. I'm like, I'm out of words. This playthrough has... has just utterly... <laughs> like, wrecked my idea of what a playthrough is in this game. It's so good. It's too... It's so easy now. It's so easy! <laughs> I, I'm trying to figure out. I thought we could encounter enemy ships in these ones, because this looks like a rather treacherous fight. Hang on a second. I, I just have yet to confirm this. I have to confirm this for myself. Yeah, I'm going to go back and replay the game. I mean, it just gives the game more replayability. You know I have to play this game many, many times. Okay. Ah, yikes. Backup battery. I don't really need mine control there. Uh, I will hack their engines. And then start shooting at their weapons directly. Weak. Okay, stealth. Just try to take them out totally. Cool, their weapons are just totally offline now. Okay, so we can encounter enemy ships. They may not be rebel ships, but it's something else that we could get. Rebel ships in this sector are actually rather difficult, too, I might add. How do you get this ship type? I can't remember what quest it is that you have to complete to unlock the stealth ship, but you there's something you gotta do. Yeah. It's definitely not the first ship in the game, though. To folks who haven't played the game much. Uh, let's see. Improving our seeing the enemy interior weapon charge power use. Uh, blasters. Blasters could be useful here. So we really haven't invested in our like personal security very much. Uh, I may take. Actually, let's just put it all on offense. We'll just go for the last two here. That way, when we do backup power, that gives us four. I think we have. Four Five, uh, could have done that a little bit better, but whatever. All right, let's go here and then try to encounter them in the next fight. Arguably should have done that with pilot in the last one. Maybe that would have been better. Okay, we will do that. And then let's go ahead and back up power. 
Yeah, actually I can't fully power those. I messed that up. But whatever, I'll take one off my evasion for a second. Mind control the pilot. Hack the engines. Okay, they are in our ship. We might not ever even have to fight this person at all, though. Like, just going at the rate we've been. Six, seven, we just have such a generous amount of time that it helps us shoot their ship for. Look, he's already killed his own entire crew. It's just haywire aboard their ship. That's wild. Okay, uh, stealth. I don't even think we need to. I should have saved it for flak, but ooh. Let's go there. Cool. No, take down that flak gun, please. Please, good. Okay, we are safe. Man, we're just peeing on the enemy ship. That's crazy. Heal. Heal. I think that's just fixer, right? Better doors are really useful for the second round of the bus. Yeah, I should have done that. Do I have enough? I think we do get some scrap from the first uh, part of the boss fight, though. Oddly enough. You know, like, you wouldn't think it leaves anything behind. I guess we just salvage the huge arm of ship that goes down. Think of the trauma the pilot experiences after the mind control. <laughs> yeah, he just, he'll go to the VA or something. The blast doors do look cool when they get upgraded. Um, is everyone at level yellow? Shield guys at yellow, engine guys at yellow, and gun guys at yellow. Pilot guy is not actually at yellow because we just haven't even had to do that much evasion. Okay, we'll wait, and then I think after this one we'll be able to upgrade the augment uh, auxiliary systems. Okay, let's see what they hack. This is going to be pretty big. There's no way of avoiding it. They're going to hack our oxygen. That is slightly problematic. Does that just tot- yep, it just totally drains the ship. Uh, are we dead? We might be dead. Hmm, we may want to jump. Hmm, yeah, I'm gonna jump. Going back to the base, I don't want to fight this fight. I don't- I haven't- done that before. It's been a while since I... I think we could, like, get them in the interim. We could probably hack their hacking so that we could prevent it from happening, but I just... I feel like there are better systems that it could have hacked. We will continue to wait. Hacked piloting. Mm, still not great, but, you know, I would have preferred it was, like, cameras or something like that. Whatever. I think we can manage. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Arguably, this is much worse. <laughs> Neither one is really good. I just, I hate managing inter-crew types of things in the meantime, and I'm like, uh, whatever. Screw it. Okay, I go stealth. Prevent them from coming after me. Then when they unstealth, we mind control them, and we hack something on their ship. So let's go ahead and mind control, um... Yeah, I say we do it with our pilot again. Then we hack the engine to pre just to prevent them from dodging anything. Then we go all of our lasers in on this rocket. Because this is the first one you want to target. Because it's just a nightmare if this thing does get to your ship. Um... Important part in the flies for... Yeah. <laughs> Okay, good. We won. Like, we basically just won. I got a little bit more time before they hack our pilot. Okay, now we're at 0% evasion. We just basically... Yeah. Good. We prevented them from ever hitting us with a missile. Because that's the worst thing that can happen in this fight. Uh, the crew member is dying. So okay, now he's dead. So now we go for lasers. Just ignore the shields for a while. Uh, cool. We also messed with their crew enough that they're pretty preoccupied with just fighting themselves off. Cool, that did nothing. Okay, ions are going to do some damage here, but I did manage to stealth in time. Pew, pew, pew. Good, go after the lasers. It's basically rockets, lasers, ions, and then go for everything else. Just ignore shields at first for a bit. 
Okay, cool that guy's down. And now we can take out the ions. Turn on the hacking again. I feel so much more calm during this fight than I used to because it... I mean, we're also like <laughs> ridiculously overpowered weapon combo right here. But still, even so, I feel calm. Ooh, cool. Mind control time. Uh, still at 41% of aid. Nice. Take out the pilot again. Cur oh, it even tells you their current evasion. I never actually noticed that. Okay, now I think we could just go for anything. Let's just take down the shields to take them down fast. Cool. That was easy. That was stupid easy. Uh, we will go for... Hmm. See the evasion if they hack the engines or piloting. Oh, really? Nice. I didn't notice that. I think I could go for doors. Yeah, because, I mean, we're already getting stuff from manning these rooms. Yeah, I'll take doors. Just because the next couple phases we're going to be seeing um, a lot of boarding. That'll help us. All right. Okay, here is arguably the most difficult phase of the boss fight, Drone Swarm. Drones. Uh, I'll take one little bit off of evasion for now. We will, again, mind control the pilot whilst we hack the engines. I think I've started to like these combat patterns, guys. I not thought of hacking the engines until you guys suggested it. Okay, they are in the mind control room, and they are attacking the mind control room. Honestly, not a bad room to attack, but I still want them gone. I will send out you and you to get him. Just don't let them hit us with our ro with their rockets. It's like the worst thing that can happen. Blech. All right, now I'm scared. There's so many things coming at my ship. I'm just going to leave them. Oh, whoops. I almost let you die. That is a very nice sound effect. I don't know what I would do without that. Okay, Dangler, get in there and repair. Okay, Drone Swarm, we're getting it right here. As long as Vulcan is firing at that thing. Okay, we're fine now. We just won. Get their lasers, and then we'll get the drones. Okay, now I need to power the med bay. Uh, power the med bay for just a second. Top secret. Get in there. Look at just all the missiles we have is insane. How did we get this much firepower? Okay, now we go in for their drones because that's their last source of, like, penetrating our shields. Take that down for a second. Okay, now I want to turn back on my evade. It's like down for too long. What a joke. Man, Vulcan just wins these fights. As soon as you get Vulcan, that's game. That's wild. <laughs> that's so cool. I'm going to have to start turning up the difficulty now. Oh, cool. I've always wanted to be good at this game so that you could actually watch it, like, live. Although I don't think I've gotten any better. I think I just got lucky this time. Uh, you two go in there, get some health care. Cool. But it is cool when you can more or less see the final, like, endgame boss. Real time. Because so much of the time you have to, like, pause and unpause. Were the missiles active there at the end? There's one of the fights where you have to be very careful because if you kill the whole crew, then the ship comes, like, alive. And that's clearly not a good thing. Uh, let's go ahead and just get the last of the um, cameras because the cameras are pretty cool. We'll go to the base and do the final fight. But if you misclick in this part, you, like, lose the whole game. <laughs> just be careful. Okay, we will unmind control the mind control. So turn on three of those. Not sure how much of a difference this is going to make. And then we go ahead and turn on our hacking. Uh, we won't be able to use hacking for a second, though. So let's just take that off, put it onto engines. We will unmind control ourselves. Unacceptable. Mm. Improving the med bay. Possibly. 
Maybe for when they board, there is that, which I'm now gonna go through. Okay, we'll just send our mantis friend out. Go, mantis friend. Okay, they are shooting things at us now. Okay, that was their missile barrage. Basically the only scary weapon. Okay, I think now we are ready to hack. Oh wait, no, not yet. Whoops. In like two seconds. Uh, don't die. Power the mid bay. Turn down our evade. Uh, turn down everything. Turn down our everything. Okay, no, they are beginning to mind control us again. Uh, unmind control again. This is such a nuisance, this fight. Okay, now we can hack their engines. Go back in and fight them again. But don't kill all of them because that's bad. Everything shoots. Okay, I wish I could avoid that, but I can't. All right, that was our first hull damage we've taken in like 20 fights. Uh, um, here we go this way. Didn't even really need to bring them into the med bay, but yeah. Okay, good. That's what Dangler's supposed to do in there. Actually, you head in there too. Or just stay in there. I don't think we're in much danger. Power's down to our uh, weapons, though. Nope. Turn those back on. Uh, take out the lasers now. Yeah. I don't want to handle lasers anymore because they still have the super weapon, which is pretty strong. Pretty much gets through, like, any amount of shields. Oh, darn. They just took our... P mind controlling my pilot... Hang on a second. Uh, don't do that. Undo. Okay, Dangler, get in there and help him. All right, now we've taken down that system. Now let's just take down their shields. Or t stop them. Stop mind controlling me. That's really annoying. Okay, stealth for the super weapon. Good. Die. Go back to your rooms. All except for Captain Secret. Oh no, that's the whole game. We just beat it. Getting better at the... I mean, great RNG. That was, I think, one of the best runs I've ever had. Maybe the best run of all time. Took one damage in the whole fight. Oh, I might have got an achievement if I didn't get any damage, right? Still, there will be many more FTL runs to, re to come. An amazing game. One of the greatest games. Uh, or, honestly, one of my favorite games. One of the best roguelikes. Uh, ever out. Let's go ahead and see stats here. Okay, this is kind of exciting now. No, it was my second best run ever. Second best score. Only by like 26 points. Or 16. The Taurus. Yeah, the Taurus stands the best. I wish you could replay some of these runs. Crew records. Most repairs. Steven. John Caldwell. Oh, I could get Slurm. Oh, yeah, that was one of our slugs. <laughs> Survived 100, 100 jumps. Jeez. Um, what were the ship best? Okay, ship best. Uh, yeah, that was our easily our best. Um, we'll go back to the hangar for just a second. Anyway, my goal has been to unlock the secret ship. Uh, unfortunately, we did not get either of the achievements. I wasn't really paying attention to. But we did beat the game with type A. So go back and unlock these, and then we're going to try to make our way through. Yeah, we've now beaten the game with type A of every one of the basic ships, aside from Lanius, which doesn't really matter for this. 